Hey guys, how's it going? It's Eric here at Farpoint Farms and I am excited to try this thing out. The V11 Pro from Phoenix, capturing your happy moments from above. I've owned quite a few drones now. Some of them I've given away to friends and family, but I have kept a few of them. And if I'm going to be honest, I've also crashed quite a few of them, not intentionally. And uh, so I was excited to check this one out this is one of the larger models heavier models it takes 8k resolution photos and 4k resolution video and so uh, let's go ahead and unbox this thing i'll charge the batteries up it is a beautiful fall day here in the mountains the power's back on and i wanted to check this thing out and uh, get some footage all right so here we are with our main unit this one has uh it's a digital display readout here on the bottom we have our little joysticks for the for the controllers this slides up and we can put a uh, camera in there and very cool and then up on top here the controls for uh, panning and tilting the uh... oh that's cool okay so pan and tilt and then we also have a zoom it looks like the zoom feature all right. Oh, it has like a safety lock for these. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. So this is going to be even less forgiving. <laughs> this is more of a professional one than I'm used to playing with. These blades do not fold in. These blades are much larger than the other drones that I've checked out. So this is kind of a cool setup here. So here is our main unit here. We have a camera here we have some led lighting on the bottom and uh, i'm not sure what that all is i'll have to do some reading here and you know, there's actually stickers all over the place here so i'll have to check all that out to see what's going on um, cool all right and it has like this thing here which locks it into place the other thing that's nice about this is it does come with two batteries and let's see do they have a full charge oh they do cool so we can take this right outside and fly it and of course this also probably carries an s yeah micro sd card i'll have to grab a micro sd card for this thing and uh, grab that for it but uh yeah, overall. Oh, I see. Okay, so these are actually landing pads here. <laughs> That's awesome. And the battery just kind of, you just pull up on it. USB-C charging. Let's see what this one has in it. Okay, this one came with three. So we should definitely be able to fly this around today. Awesome. So pretty significant piece of machinery, no doubt. And then we have some other stuff in here. So I've had, a, the most similar that I can think of is I had a Roku, a Ruko, the name's so similar. Um, and I used it, uh, and that's the one I just, just crashed it, trying to get some footage of the, of the dam and, and some of the stuff that was damaged here in the storm. So it does come with four sets of blades extras. So when you destroy this, not if, but when, uh, you can replace those. That's cool. And then we got some charging cables here, USB-C. These look like adapters, let's see. Yeah, the like old iPhones and, and minis. And so we have that. And then lastly here, Yeah, another USB-C. So you can charge the batteries, which have their own USB-C. And then this as well has a USB charger as well. Let's see what this is, if this has a charge in it. 58%, so enough to fly it anyway. So that's very cool. Okay. As far as the rest of it goes here, this, uh, you pull this up. This is the protector. Let me get that out of there. Ah! And this is what holds our camera, you know, stability-wise, the safety. And let me get the, uh, wow, that thing jiggles around. 
it is a 4K camera, which is a big upgrade from any of the other ones. Now, this is something I've learned the hard way. Um, the, uh, there we go. These cameras will only operate in 4K from the SD card or take 8K pictures from the SD card. When it's transmitting the information back down to planet Earth, the uh, issue you run into there is that, uh, you know, you, with the bandwidth and whatever, you're getting, you're getting like 720p back at your camera. But with, uh, you know, an onboard SD card, you, you know, the sky's the limit, literally. It's kind of a joke, but it's not. The sky's the limit as far as you, you can go out there and you can really get some really high quality photos. Now, the leaves are changing color uh, due to the storm. The top of the ridge is already in winter mode. They've lost all the leaves up there. It went straight from green to gone. A lot of trees came down across the way as well. But I'll take you around. We'll fly up as high as we can and we'll take a look. It's amazing to me. I was checking this out earlier with the other drone before I wrecked it. And, um, and like so much of it looks fine from, you know, 500 feet up, but uh, it ain't, it ain't fine. So. Cool. Well, let me pause the camera and what I'm going to do here, I'll just fade away with music and uh, some, some sights of Farpoint Farms in the fall.